What up 2K fans? Welcome to NBA 2K16 gameplay number two. As I said in the first video, I won't be speaking too much. I just want you guys to focus on the gameplay and the sound, but I will give you a focus point. Pay close attention to the situational motion system. This is where players are moving around, getting open on their own without the use of calling, without having to call plays. And also pay close attention to the new pick and roll system and just picks in general. Ariza against Paul. Always going up for the LU here, and Griffin slams it in. Boy, the prettiest play in basketball to me. Execute it to perfection. I don't think you're going to get an argument there. Everybody loves the alley -oop. No doubt about it, unless you're the dunky. Because yeah. if you're the dunker, it's great. <laughs> I don't necessarily appreciate somebody slamming one on the top of my head. Well, you got to get out from under the hoop if you want to stay away, if you want to stay out of the poster. <laughs> oh, Maestro, he is so good at making those lead passes, like conducting an orchestra. To end the run, no good from Howard. Boy, Doc Rivers keeps on leading his teams to successful seasons. A former right here, I want you guys to take a look at the new pick and roll system. You now have the option to push R2 or right trigger, and now you have the choice of making the guy setting the pick switch sides. Of the year, rarely has a season where his team doesn't meet expectations. Good ball movement here by the Clippers. Paul kicks to Reddick from 10 feet out. And all will come to win that time before dropping in. Reddick's got his first points of the night. Cole Aldrich, he's checked in for DeAndre Jordan. Smith comes in for Blake Griffin. Lance Stevenson's checked in for Pierce. And it's Crawford in for J.J. Reddick. Now here's Jones. He's been producing a fair amount of offense night in and nine out as he's averaging 14 points a game. All against Beverly. Screen by Smith. Paul dishes to Smith. And he dunks it after the pick frees him up. A nice job again. That time to add to their lead. They're doing everything right at the moment. Greg, you're exactly right. Good, solid, steady, no frills basketball. Doing it in all aspects of the game right now. And that's a hard combination to beat. Ariza with the buckets. Perfect screen there. Set him up with a terrific look. Yeah, I like the fact that the setup was good, the screen was solid, but you also have to look at the fact that the defender didn't do his job as well as he could have. Now here's Paul. He's been a nice option for them offensively, and he's averaging more than 17 points a game. Back to Crawford. Brewer with the steal. Here's Beverly. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. It's going to be Lance Stevenson. The Rockets shooting their first free throws here tonight. And the season numbers for them at the line thus far are, are really poor. Something I'm sure they are making a point of emphasis. And Kevin, it's something they've been working very hard to correct in the change. I mean, they know how important it is to fix that inability at the free throw line. Paul passes to Stevenson. Wants to Pay close attention to Jamal Crawford's shake and bake size up. Get it to Crawford and does. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. First trip to the line for him here. No good on the free throw. And he sinks the second. And guys, Wesley Johnson, fourth overall pick back in the 2011 draft. Everyone thought he would have the jump shot to become a prolific scorer. And Clark, the link to defend at a high level. Yeah, you know, in his rookie year, he averaged nine points a game. Last year, his fifth, he averaged 10. I think it's to the point where he is what he is. Just over one minute has passed here in the second quarter. Harden against Crawford. Harden kicks to Monte Yunus. That one wide left. And, and they continue to control the glass. Guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team, and that's why they're ahead. Playing smart offensively in the first half, no doubt about it. Yeah, the numbers support it. I mean, they're shooting the much better percentage from the field so far. If you look so that does it for video number two. 
Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. If you like this video, smack that like tab to show your support and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll have some more NBA 2K16 gameplay for you, for guys, you guys later. later.